Back to that breaking news now. Sherry Papini posting $120,000 bail, walking out of the Sacramento County Jail within the last hour. There you see CBS 13 Steve Large. He was there when it all happened. I have never seen a sight quite like that, Steve. Yeah, more like a sprint outside the Sacramento County Jail doors. And we were rolling when it happened. You can see the blonde bangs of Sherry Papini underneath a, a hoodie, and she's wearing a mask. So you really never get a glimpse of her face here. And then ultimately, uh, her family ends up escorting her a block away as reporters kind of surround her with cameras trying to get a question. And you're watching the video now uh, showing you how this all unfolded. Just a chaotic situation here. Uh, as she's released from jail some two hours after a judge allowed her uh, to post bail, that six-figure sum that you just mentioned there. Uh, reporters asking her, what does she have to say? Uh, did, in fact, she lie to investigators as the federal government is alleging? Uh, and as you can see, the crowd just continuing to move down the street. At one point, she gets into a vehicle that had been waiting a, a block away, uh, and she gets into the back seat and she gets a big hug. Uh, one of our camera shots did capture that moment, but uh, there was a, a very emotional uh, moment here where you could hear Sherry Papini crying. Uh, but these are very serious allegations stemming from her uh, reported kidnapping several years back, and then she was found on the side of the road in Yolo County, uh, and the story went national. Ultimately, the federal government saying she lied about the whole thing, uh, and she ended up detained, in fact, arrested on Friday. Today was uh, her first court appearance regarding a uh, detention hearing, a judge allowing her to be released, uh, and that's how it all played out. So she's going to be back in court on March 25th, for uh, another court date.